A new movie shot and based in Grand Rapids is now in theaters. The Juneteenth Comedy Block Party was created by a local filmmaker. News hates Jacqueline Francis with a sneak peek tonight. Summer Sizzle is a Grand Rapids institution. Your grandmother was celebrating Juneteenth way before it was a federal holiday. I'm hitting the big screen. Block Party tells the story of a recent Harvard grad who puts her career on hold in order to save her grandma's historic Juneteenth Block Party, reconnecting with her hometown along the way. What are you doing here? Why are you in Michigan? I wanted to come check on Graham Jam. Created and produced by Grand Rapids native Lisa Mathis, the story is inspired by her own memories growing up in a tight-knit neighborhood. We would go to Martin Luther King Park and people would pull out their barbecues and someone would pull out a boom box and it would just be, be like a block party every Sunday at the park. And all of a sudden a light bulb moment went off. I'm like, oh my gosh, we've got to write this movie block party. And I knew it had to be based in the Martin Luther King Park neighborhood in Grand Rapids because so many amazing characters we met there throughout my lifetime came from there. So I thought it would be great. Bringing her vision to life, the movie was shot in Grand Rapids last fall. The star-studded cast turning heads while on set at Martin Luther King Park. They would sit out and watch. They would sit and watch us. They were, knew my name from like two blocks away, and they were hollering and waving. And House of Style, Barber and Beauty is another local spot featured in the movie. The film's creator basing one of the characters off her real life cousin and the salon owner, Deborah. Deborah, for you, what was it like to have this movie filmed here? It was surreal. It was a wonderful experience having stars, celebrities, all sh here in Grand Rapids shooting a movie. It was unbelievable, actually. And having a character based off you, what's that like? It was so much fun. I got to see what people think of me as a person. Ultimately, this movie is a comedy, but also it's a very heartwarming story. For a list of showtimes and theaters, head to our website, woodtv.com. Reporting in Grand Rapids, Jacqueline Francis, News 8.